In terms of then you 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 working with with Jack, do you kind of you said you already knew at Barnsley? Um, what other so you the the manager you kind of work with now? Obviously, he was at Barnsley for a period of time, but he wasn't there when you first started. So, how do you kind of find working with different managers then, Nathan? Because obviously, every manager is different; they've got their own philosophy. They come in, they might want to come in and totally change things, or some might come in and just let you kind of get on with it. How like how many managers did you work with at Barnsley, if you remember? Um, one that's I think Eckenbottom, Murray, this is Murray, Stendhal, uh, Strubert, Murray, Ishmael, Shop, Lowman. So eight, eight or nine, I think eight or nine. Um, that's including a couple of interims, yeah. So yeah. eight, or nine, yeah. But when you think oh, I was only there full time, I was there for for three seasons really. Hmm. So you you're firing through, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, yeah, eight or nine managers. In fact, Poyo as well, like Poyo is 10, so we've come up to about 10 managers. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a bit crazy, mate. It's, it was funny at Barnes, it's like when I, my second internship year, um, when uh, Daniel Stendhal was there, was kind of like, in my head, that's my first year because the remote stuff was great, but you yeah. say you're at uni and whatever else. Because Barnes at the time was such like a heavy pressing club and, and it kind of maintained that throughout my time there, yeah, that always stays. Like obviously, managers have different. There's a million different ways to press and different triggers and whatever else. But at the end of the day, you kind of know you're going to be an aggressive pressing team. Um, yeah. So that never changes. What you've got to uh, adapt to, I think, and I think every analyst and any aspiring analyst has to do it is is the personality of the manager and what how he wants his work. Yeah. So uh, with some managers, particularly Daniel at the start, we had like an in possession, out possession set play videos, but they'd be like maybe nine minutes long each. The set players were more about four or five. And you went from that and you had to add in, there wasn't too many animations in them, but there was of sort. Yeah. You'd go from that to um, Gerhard came in and you'd go right down to like basically three minutes, three minutes, two minutes. But then you have it to put better clips in per se, but they were yeah. maybe heavily animated. Yeah. And then different personalities, different ways they like to work. Some managers want to get involved with you and they'll sit and talk to you. Others are just, I'm the manager out of the way. So that's, I think they're the biggest difference that I've always found. Like, But because I've had so many in such a quick row, I've kind of learned how to, yeah. you learn how to adapt quite quickly. Yeah, definitely. So, um, I mean, you've obviously kind of made an impression on on the, the manager you've got now in uh, Besiktas, obviously. Um, he was the... Was he the no? He wasn't the last manager you had at Barnsley, was he? Because obviously he'd have gone and you'd have. No, no, no. We had a we had a few after. Something yeah. after, so we had a few after. <laughs> a few after. <laughs> um, but obviously that was your introduction to him. So when when he left, um, and we we're speaking about this is um, I don't want to say his name wrong. Uh, <laughs> uh, Va- Valerie and Ishmael is that a master? Valerie and Ishmael, yeah. Not you're not you're not far off, Valerie. Far off. Okay, perfect. So when so he he kind of moved on from so like you said Barnsley got the playoffs. Barnsley had a really good season then, didn't they? They actually made the playoffs and they were punching kind of fed say punching above the weight almost. So um, but then again he he left. He moved on to West Brom and he right he took. Jack went with him to West Brom, didn't he, at that point? So, um, but obviously you're still at Barnsley at that point. A new manager comes in, etc. Um, and then the season after, obviously Barnsley don't do as well um, and find it hard in the league, which is a very difficult league to to kind of um, to play in it at the best of time. So, 